Welcome. This is just going to be a short video rehashing the Arduino TMP37 temperature controller. I'm your host, Louis Laughlin. Visit my website at www.bristolwatch.com. The TMP37 must rank as a really, really simple temperature controller. It's fairly accurate, easy to hook up, easy to program. As you see above here, looking at the bottom, it's a simple three-pin device, and they have some four-pin versions. I use the three-pin version myself. A brief explanation of what we're doing here. This takes some understanding of the Arduino analog to digital converter port. Okay? The... Uh, ADC ports, analog to digital converters on the Arduino, is a 10-bit value from 0 through 1023. Set at a reference voltage of 5 volts, that is 4.882 millivolts per step. Now the TMP37 produces an output of 20 millivolts per degree Celsius. This is a Celsius sensor. As you can see by the two numbers, they don't exactly match up. But you would have four steps for every 20 millivolts, so that's fairly close. All it amounts to is a few simple mathematical equations, which Arduino is easily capable of doing, and one connection to any of your analog to digital input ports. What you're going to see in the video is a little different than before. I've connected this to an IT IC2 display, which is much simpler than the original uh, multi-pin connections I've had before. And again, I did a uh, comparative reading of... It came within 1.5 degrees of a laboratory analog thermometer. I don't have a digital but I plan to be using this to hatch chicken eggs and a degree or two is not going to going to hurt considering the sensor is about a buck or two real quick look at the program this is the whole program okay you're just going to do an analog read on zero if you go back and look at it it only has three connections one pin goes to positive one pin goes to ground, one pin goes to your Arduino. All you're going to do is read the analog port. You're going to get the four point, whatever it was, 882 millivolts per step. That's your, uh, that's done there. You divide that value by 0 0.02. Then you just simply do a conversion from Celsius to Fahrenheit. You print out your Fahrenheit. There you go. Otherwise you can take actually the original value even if you want it to in Celsius. You can do a comparison to a preset number and easily switch off some of the solid state relays that I've presented in several recent videos. So that's the whole deal for you. Now you're going to see a, pic a video of this being done live. Uh, appreciate you uh, watching this video. Stay tuned for more coming your way. Thanks for listening. Well, what we got here is an Arduino with a TMP37 temperature sensor. This must rank as the most simple, easy way to read temperature with any Arduino out there. I plan to use this particular design to run a chicken incubator and hatch chicks. Nonetheless, it consists of a single three-pin device that you see here. This is just a power distribution board. It's not really part of the circuit. Common Arduino Nano. I plan to use an AT, I think they're teeny 85 on the final design, but works the same way. This is an ICE 2C serial LCD display and it's uh, measuring the temperature in this room. 
the uh, the one it has the sensor itself has a ground plus five and an output the output goes to any analog pin you just read the analog voltage you make a calculation and then display it on whatever you want to display it on that simple if you want a quick easy way to read temperature with an Arduino this is the way to go doesn't involve any fancy digital stuff very low overhead on the processor uh, I think it's great uh, we'll look at a few more slides either before this at the beginning of this video or after but nonetheless I appreciate your time and good luck out there Visit my website at www.bristolwatch.com.